Standing around. That's a hell of a shot. Why chalk 
score the goal for number six, Ian Kirby. And he is with Ian with 8.33. Touches the pipe. in by six, Ian Kirby. And advantage. Goal number six, Ian Kirby. Spins. Bents with the ball. He has the Massapequa goal inside, and oh, they made that one look easy. Ian Kirby, the tally. Kirby from Bents, 2 1, Massapequa. Comes with 244 left in the first quarter. Was, I think the second best team in Washington, but there are only about five teams, maybe six in the state of Washington, and it goes in, it bounces in. Give the goal to Ian Kirby, his second goal of the game. You can see that Massapequa was narrowing the box, and with a minute 36 remaining in the first half, they go up by four, their biggest lead of the game at 6-2. Ian Kirby, heavily recruited sophomore. According to head coach Tim Radomski, he can rip it, but that was more of a finish. It was Jake Korber in control behind the net to Gallivan. Gallivan trying to pass across the crease intended Ian Kirby and puts it home. Almost didn't think that Kirby had enough room to get the shot off. Ian Kirby. And the massive peak will lead increases back to three at 7-4. Goal comes with 646 remaining in the third. And for Ian Kirby, it's very quick and big time potential James Burns. Right now it's Korber. Pass in front, Ian Kirby, and a goal! His fifth of the game, Ian Kirby! And Massapequa has opened a 10-4 lead. 8-24 remaining in the fourth. You know, Port can come out and challenge them, but that may isolate, set up a two-on-one or three-on-one in front. Like there is a one-shot and a goal. Ian Kirby, goal number six of the game. Extra man goal with 5.05 remaining. Ian Kirby fed by his brother Ryan. And brotherly love in Massapequa. It's the Chiefs 12 and Port Washington he scored five. from far. He scored from close in. He may score here. And he does. Seventh goal by Ian Kirby. Wow. Four minutes, 13 seconds remaining in this one. And it's 13 to 5 in favor of Massapequa. This one. Cloudy in Hempstead, Long Island, but the sun shining brightly, if it can get by the clouds, on the Massapequa Chiefs. 14 to 5 victors over Port Washington. The Chiefs advance to the Nassau County Conference A final. And a big reason for that is because the gentleman to my left, Ian Kirby, who well, let me tell you something, Ian. When I spoke to your head coach, he said, well, Ian can rip it. He is a cannon-like shot. But did you ever expect seven goals against a quality team like Port Washington in a Nassau County Conference semi? You know, I just play to play, you know. Like, I don't know. I was expecting goals, but not seven. Like, this is big for me. I don't know. I'm only a sophomore. I don't even know how to... I don't even know how to explain myself right now. I'm, just, I'm in shock. Well, a coach would say that's a good thing because you weren't thinking out there. You were reacting. Exactly. You think that'd be the case? Yeah, of course. All right, now, your brother, Ryan, who also is a pretty good lacrosse player in his own right, I know that at the point of the game in the third quarter when you had five or six goals, you were trying to set him up, but yeah. he eventually got a goal, but not with your assist. Yeah, of course. You know, he, he's a great player. He's, he gets more assists than me because he's a smart player. He's smarter than me. But, you know, us put together as a great tandem. Was it expected by Massapequa to make the county final? No. I was uh, and coming into it. I was really uh, disrespected about that because I thought we were going to be good enough. No one else thought we did, but we just kept going. We didn't care about what anyone else thought. We just went. How do you feel that Farmingdale is not in contention this year? Oh, great. <laughs> Farmingdale, the defending New York State champs. Oh, All right. For a while. <laughs> Ian, congratulations on the win. Any preference as to who you may want to face, Syosset or Baldwin? Syosset. 
Oh, it's my alma mater, so I don't know. I may have to root for that. But anyway, it's banked. No, it's <laughs> Ian, good luck to you. All right, thank you. The words, Ian Kirby, seven goals. Massive pick with beating poor Washington by the score of 14-5. to five. For my ace producer and camera person, Jen Uline, I'm Bob Gallerstein. This is Camera One, MSG Varsity. Thank you.